This video is brought to you by Timu, the online shopping site. Hi, welcome to Kevin's Web. My name is Mark, and in this video, I'm going to take a look at this uh, beauty airbrush system um, that I picked up on Timu. Uh, continuing my series of uh, products from Timu that are ideal for gamers and collectors and miniature painters. So um, this is, as it says on the box, beauty airbrush system. It's a portable, portable uh, airbrush system that's compact. The box itself is just plainly, basically a plain box. There's nothing um, out of order on that. There's no images or anything on it. Um, I did check that everything's here and it is, so we're just gonna quickly jump in. So um, this isn't gonna be a very long video. Okay, so this is a Rhino Wisdom Airbrush Kit. We have our, um, one second, let's put this down. We have our instruction manual, which is all in English, I think. Um, yes, it's all in English. So the basic instruction manual, it's very cheap. I mean, the airbrush itself is quite cheap um, because it was only 12 pounds. We've got a small um, cup, which I think is uh, 10 mil, and we've got a 25 and a sorry, a, yeah, 25 and a 50 mil um, container. If I can get them out. These just screw into the top of the airbrush itself. Put that in there for the moment. We don't need that. We've got our charging cable. We've got some cleaners and a pipette, which are you know not cheap themselves. We've got the airbrush. Now this is a single action airbrush. It's not a dual action. Um, as far as the, uh, the way I've been telling yeah, it's a single action. So a single action airbrush, um, when you press back on the air, on the trigger, it actually releases the air flow, whereas um, with the paint as well, whereas a dual action is slightly different and a little bit easier to use. And then we've also got the uh, compressor itself. Now it was meant to come with a hose but for some reason there's no holes in this uh, unless I chose the wrong one. I think I may have chosen the wrong one. I think the pink one was the one that came with the hose. Okay so we've got a mini compressor, two speeds, um, obviously it needs charging but it's got some charge in it. It's a lot quieter than my compressor and the way the airbrush goes on is just basically spin it round like this and when it's on tight um, first of all you need to turn it on <laughs> so and then the uh, I don't know if you can actually there's air coming out of it yep now obviously there's no there's no um water or paint or anything in there at the moment so that makes it a little bit uh, uh that makes it a little so it just, you can't see how it works so i'm going to get this set up and we'll go to my painting station and um we'll actually have a look at it and see how good it is for the miniature painter so uh, as i said this is going to be quite a short video i'm not really going to go through too much with it i'm just going to uh, show you how it works now the the product itself was 22 pounds and even if it just helps for undercoating models it's a bargain at that price because um, you save a lot, a lot of money on rattle cans so um, I'll get this over to the airbrush station and um, we'll be right back and carry on with it. Okay folks welcome back right so um, I've got a um, 3d printing warthog here that failed um, I don't want to get rid of it because I'm going to use it as a piece of terrain because it looks pretty good. It's all bashed up. It's got holes in the right places, but it failed due to a problem on my uh, screen. So I'm going to use this as a quick test um, with the airbrush. Okay, so um, you'll have to bear with me because I'm trying to do this in a quite cramped space uh, because I've got lots and lots of boxes in front of my airbrush station for some reason. So basically, I'm going to put the airbrush on. And I'm just gonna see if this works. And as you can see, straight away, you know, this is just um, a sky gray um, paint. 
and it's going on really well. There's absolutely no um, no issues with it. There's no spray back, and I haven't even thinned this down. It's just a it's a um, a, a um, Vallejo uh, uh, acrylic, so it's designed for airbrushes. But as you can see, it just goes on quite well. I'm having a bit of problem here trying to hold the thing steady, but for the price of the airbrush and the accessories that you get, because the accessories are like five quid, normally anyway, that's brilliant. And it's now run out of paint because I didn't put very much in the pot, so I'm just going to pop a little bit more paint in. As you can see, this is the um, Vallejo uh, Modeler Sky Blue, and just put, I don't, you don't need a tiny drop, you don't need very much because this is thinned already and designed for using with another brush. Okay, so that's um, more painting. And there we go again. Now this is on one setting, I'm not trying the other setting yet. So I'm just going to change by pressing the button at the bottom. Right, and that changes the, um, the airflow coming out of the airbrush. Which seems to be, it's quite slow, but it's actually covering really, really well. Right, so, let's try and get this where you can see what I'm doing. Okay, so as I say, for the price of the airbrush, this is well worth picking up. Now, I'll leave a link in the description um, below where you can pick this up from Timo, from the vendor, and there's also a discount uh, voucher there as well. And if you're new to Timo, you can get a very, very good saving um, on your products. So um, that's my quick look through this um, Beauty Nail airbrush set from Timu. Um, it's ideal for, uh, just move this other way, it's ideal for the miniature painter in your life and well worth picking up for the price. And as I say, if you, you, you sign up using the link uh, in the description, uh, if you're new to Timu, you'll get a very special discount uh, on anything you order from Timu, including this product. So um, with that said, um, thanks again to Timu for uh, this video and thank you for staying so long um, my name is mark no matter where you are in the world please stay safe and we'll hopefully see you soon bye